Okay, starting game four here for my match against Sporting Elijah. Um, they won the last one in a long, drawn-out Traveler game. Um, old Witches and Travelers. Um, I don't think I played it particularly well, and I lost. So uh, I don't feel terrible about that. Let's take a look at this kingdom. So the only village... Well, it's not in any effective village. There's a throne room, but throne room doesn't do a lot. Um, here, because you can't... It's really hard to increase... I guess you could throne room on treasuries, but it's really tough to make that work. Um, but you can do some trashing with Butcher and expand. Um, there's an attack with Legionary Gold. That seems real tough to, to uh, line up. Um, you can get a bunch of idols and, and curse them. I don't think Fool's Gold's going to work because it's not... I don't think it's fast enough to get enough Fool's Golds. Um, but everything else seems really, really slow. Like, you get a bar open Baron Fool's Gold, buy three Fool's Golds, get to an Expand or a Butcher, Butcher Coppers into Fool's Golds. Um, I think that's what I'm going to go for here. Question is, do I want one silver, or do I just want to dive straight into the Fool's Gold pile? Uh, the Fool's Gold's only a copper the first time through. I just don't don't see anything else being fast enough. I can get a bunch of tr can gain one treasury a turn, and then keep them on top. You're not your butchers expands. You can play one of those. Um, I think I'm going to go for the Fool's Gold stuff. Um, and so this is this is quite nice um, that I line a butcher up with an estate. I'm not going to have. I'm not going to get double fools gold. I think I'm just going to go straight for the butcher because the butcher is too strong. Um, but I'll be able to. Yeah, so that'll be out my buy this turn. So that'll be a butcher and turn. Uh, this will be another fools gold. And repeat. So they hit eight. Nice. It is not super easy to hit eight um, with opening Silver Baron. Um, so here I'm going to get. Um, I consider getting another Butcher or an Expand. Um, I think I'm going to get Butcher Fool's Gold here. Um, this is seven. Again, I'm not, not quite sure what I'm doing with 7 here. I can get the Expand already. Um, that's a lot of terminals in my deck. I can get a Throne Room. I don't have enough actions for that. Like, I don't have enough actions for a Throne Room, but I have too many terminals for another terminal. Um, I can get an Idol. That doesn't seem to fit in with what I'm doing. I guess I'll get one Treasury um, here and decide next Shuffle what my plan's going to be. Um, this will just be Butcher... Put your estate into Fool's Gold, buy a Fool's Gold. Start trashing here. Um, I can trash the Baron next time I see it with the uh, with Fool's Gold. I won't play the Baron. For, probably won't play the Baron for plus buy. Though, not sure about that. Um, so they opened Baron Silver. Um, got a Silver and Expand. A Throne Room. Uh, an Expanded Estate to a Treasury. Bought a Treasury. All seems nice. Um... So here I will butcher the Baron in, unless I draw an estate, which I don't think is it's possible, unlikely. If I draw an estate, we'll see. Um, if I don't draw an estate, I'm going to butcher the Baron into um, probably another treasury. So they've gotten a Fool's Gold now. That doesn't seem, that doesn't seem right. Um, I could even butcher this Baron into a province already. That seems so crazy. Just get a, a treasury now. And a fool's, another fool's gold. Treasury says buy a victory card. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll look for that later on. Really need to do stop playing all treasures. I was commenting on that earlier. Um, if I don't need to play all treasures, it just shows my opponent the cards. Um, and in a normal game, I wouldn't wouldn't care about that, but this is a, a championship game, so we'll see. Okay. One more Fool's Gold. Top sack that. 
So now I'm going to move pretty aggressively into greening. As I assume are they. That's sad for them. Um, I lose my two treasuries, but it's just too nice to pass up. I did also lose my plus buy, which is sad. Um, but what can you do? I'm not going to be able to play it very often. Um, so here I've got seven money and I'll two more from the butcher, so I'll be able to buy a province. And they're not at province yet, so I'm, I'm a little bit ahead here. I don't feel like I'm playing this as strong as it could be played, but um, no trash. Buy a province. So they can turn their fool's gold. They've got two fool's golds into gold. Um, I don't particularly like that. Um, so I'm not going to do that, obviously. Auto play. Buy a province. I'm, I don't know. I'm not sure what they're doing. Um, so here I've got seven money in hand. Um, so I'll play the butcher. Don't trash. And if they can double province, they can double province. I can't. I can't <laughs> catch up to that. We'll see what they do here. Um, worst comes to worst, I can butcher the treasury into a province. Um, they got 12, so I assume this will be like double double uh, duchy. Or they can figure they're behind enough and risk it, but I've got three coffers down, so that seems... Uh, um, Odd. I assume this will be double duchy. And if I draw a province with my butcher, um, I win. If I draw a fool's gold with my butcher, um, it's also really nice. I can trash the estate into a duchy. So they got one duchy and another duchy. Okay. So if I province treasury in the province, I have only four coins, so I have to draw on. Um, so let me count. This is, this is the right amount. And by the last province, Whew. it was close, but the fool's gold stuff seemed to work pretty well. Um, I don't know. Um, I could believe what, what they did could also work. Um, and I felt like it's tough for them to catch up, but they definitely had the possibility with throwing and expand to do stuff and beat me there. Um, so it's not a gimme by any, any respect. Uh, well played, I think, by Sporting Elijah, but the, the Fool's Gold stuff ended up winning. Uh, I need to win one more in Game 5, so see you then.